All right, in today's video, I'm going to talk about the new Titan Exotic Wishful Ignorance. So this close, you can obtain it from the end of the Legend campaign of the final sheep. And uh, the description says the friend, you get an extra Frenzied Blade charge and <coughs> Frenzied Blade successful strike grants you damage. And it also says the pearls from the banner also return your melee energy based on the number of allies healed. Now here's the thing, right? You can see I'm not actually playing the game. I'm watching a video pre-recorded because Bungie decided to take the servers down for quick maintenance for two hours. So I'm literally left with no, no game in my hand. But I have been testing the damages before they took it down. So I've definitely have have some numbers to go through uh, so I try to find online what are the actual uh, numbers for this but apparently since it's brand new there is no fucking uh, clue on what, what's there and what's not uh, so what I did I just took it to my hands and go to the number testing since I don't have much destiny to friends helping me out so I have to do this damage testing alone I tested the damage on the phalanx FO of the prophecy uh, note one thing in mind now there's a 25% damage surge and now we are capped minus 5 for all the activities I don't know why Bungie implemented that it's freaking stupid but I uh, can't help it now so oh, we just stick with it now as you can see the number damage goes like 26 31 and 39 uh, you can see I, I didn't learn the, the third one which I will in the next clip uh, for in my following damage numbers you can see the last damage was 52,000 so with all these things in mind I actually put I actually did some math on my own so graphic designing is my passion but I can do good mathematics so as uh, from all I calculated so it gives you for 25% damage buff for the first successful strike for two successful strikes you get 50% damage buff and for three successful strikes you get 200% damage buff so this is like expending all of your frenzy blade melee so uh, in this uh, keep in mind there is no banner of war active there's no one to punch shotgun involved so this is clear the lowest you can get uh, from the gloves also one thing to keep in mind with banner it will do 40% extra damage on all the base values on top of this you can get 100% more damage from the one to punch shotgun from what I've heard on Twitter I couldn't press on the try it out since the service went down you can shoot in between each successful strike to proc one two punch so if that's true this will be huge but the only problem is I can, as you can see uh, for any pro sizable damage you're sneak going to spend all of your all of your fucking melee charges to in order to mitigate that uh, it also has a secondary perk where pulses from your banner of war written melee energy based on the number of allies sealed so as i said i didn't get to try it out much so i do have some base footage which i can explain you on how i got it so for the first one i just stood next to my friend using the banner of war and i checked the melee regeneration rate uh this one is slightly inconsistent because uh their melee is regening while also you get the chunks of uh, melee energy back for healing an ally but i did pull up the photoshop to do some number crunching again so as you can see using photoshop i just counted out the pixels of difference and from my calculation i got the first one at around 20 percent this one is inconsistent as i said because i was also regening so the lower line may be lower than what i expected than the upper line but i got 20 percent for healing one ally and it, this did not change for the stacks of banner i had it's like for every pulse you get 20 percent back so since you are at four pulse it will give you like the more pulse gives you quicker the 20 20 percent back since i was playing gambit match as well i have also come up with the damage of healing two allies at once this one resulted in around 30 percent melee return almost 30 percent melee return as i said this is inconsistent i'm pretty sure good da good data crunchers can do it better than me i was alone so this is all i could do without any assistance of somebody else i think get, uh, uh, getting melee chunks from when having two allies around is more of a sizable number because uh, even in rays and dungeons where this this thing will shine uh, is that you can, i don't think you'll be around more than like two or three members for like longer durations but let's say you have banner for stacks four and you're next to like four or maybe five allies then of course yeah you you get all of your wheel back very quickly though i do not know the exact numbers for the for, for having three people around or having four people around or five people around that is done but i have done the calculations for one and two for one is 20 percent back and for having two allies around it's around 30 percent back but then when when you have woven mail you also get 200 percent base melee regeneration than already what you have so on top of that the chunks you know it's hard to calculate though i don't have much gameplay for it as a thanks to destiny taking on the servers uh, that's about it for me thanks for watching